Well, here we are on Thanksgiving week. It's hard to believe. What an exciting week this is. A whole week of gratitude and thanksgiving to God. In 2 Corinthians, it says this, 3, verse 17 and 18. Let me give you this biblet. Now, the Lord is the Spirit. And where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. Spirit means that God is everywhere present. Not just some places, not just in the four walls of a church, but wherever you go, you cannot be anywhere where God is not. And you realize this, and as you realize this, it equips you with a new freedom and a new power of freedom. I continue. And all of us, being transformed into the same image, realize that you are being transformed into those godly attributes. You don't have to remain in the animalistic type of living of life in thinking and in action. No, you rise up higher and you will be transformed into the spiritual. And as you do, it will give you a tremendous freedom from who you used to be in your life and your future life. And I continue, we're being transformed into the same image from one degree of glory to another. Well, as you step up a little bit, you'll begin to feel better. It will be a tremendous glory inside of you. But you also have the free will choice to step up a lot more than just one degree, but a whole lot. And the more you do, the more freedom you will feel. Imagine for just a moment that you're completely free with the freedom of spirit. Well, what does this mean? You're free from worry, number one. You're free from doubt. You're free from any sense of insecurity. Can you imagine where you no longer have insecurity in your life. What would you do in your life if you didn't have insecurity? Well, equipped with God, you will have this feeling of freedom. As you think about freedom of spirit, I ask you to release any lower human thought and let wave after wave of God's peace move throughout your body how relaxed you will feel as you do this. How much peace you will have with yourself, but also with your world and with your family. Now, you store up this feeling of freedom in your memory so that you have a spiritual reserve memory so that you can claim it at any time that you need it. And you can claim freedom because you're free with the freedom of spirit. God's loving spirit, it's always with you. And it is the spirit of God within you that will transform your life into one of everlasting peace. And you'll be living a manifestation of a life of complete freedom. Now, before I say goodbye, let me make an announcement. Black Friday, the day after Thanksgiving, we're going to have a huge sale on all of our books, tear-off calendars, and CDs. Be watching for positive daily inspiration this Friday. It will have special codes that you can put in to get special, incredible savings. Black Friday, Positive Christianity.